record lows here in Kansas City. It's the second coldest game ever for the Chiefs and the coldest game conditions that the Miami Dolphins in their history. He's brought great life to this Miami team. It's Patrick Cobbs back waiting for Connor Barth's kickoff. Takes it at the 10 yard line and Cobbs finds the sidelines and he's going to get a good return out of this. Cuts back inside. Chase from behind at the 40 and he's out of bounds at the 32 yard line of the Chiefs. What a start. So from the 31 Chad Pennington sets his line. Great field position to open it up. He fakes to the fullback and gives to Ted Ginn on the reverse and Ginn plenty of running room 10 10 5 touchdown. Oh my two plays and a quick Miami announcement here in Kansas City. And this is where Miami brings the pressure in Porter but Thigpen has time to throw and it's intercepted by Goodman Andre Goodman to the 40 to midfield he's got blockers in front. Only Thigpen to stop him and he's able to block him out of bounds inside the 20 yard line. Boy did that pass sail. Well he's trying to throw it to Tony Gonzalez and Gonzalez is double covered. Light in front of him. Brown's out to the right side and then in motion and there's the handoff to Brown and he is dragged down by Demario Williams in the backfield for a loss. Let's see how the win affects Carpenter's 34 yard try. It is <laughs> just good. And Johnson with the first carry of the afternoon. He's got good yardage to the 40 and dragged down at the 35 by Yermaya Bell. Start in the triple right and Gonzalez ever in motion. And it's back to Johnson trying. No, he's faked. And then Thigpen throws toward the end zone. Touchdown! DeVar Darling. Oh, my. Great ball handling by Thigpen. And in that treacherous wind condition, he floats one to Bradley, who has his first fourth touchdown of the season. No, Darling's first touchdown of the season. Second and four. Pennington down the middle. Caught by tight end Fasano and Anthony Fasano. They're attacking at the linebacker position, the ball. Four yard loss, second and 14. Pennington a screen to the right and he is not going to get anything out of this as Brown is surrounded by red jerseys. And this swarming Kansas City defense, however young and however mistake prone, they'll come and hit you, Brandon Flowers. A triple left formation here in the spread. Larry Johnson with thick pen in the backfield for the Chiefs. Under seven left in the opening quarter. Throw underneath, and it's complete to Mark Bradley. And Bradley spins out. So much uh, playoff consideration still at stake, including these Miami Dolphins who need two wins to secure the AFC East. A pass is to Gonzalez, and Gonzalez. Yard line earlier, and that wind is dead at your back where Thigpen is. Throw underneath to Gonzalez for about six, seven. And Arizona seems thrilled to be out east again, <laughs> don't they? Helping New England stay in this AFC East race. Big Ben on second down throws again to Gonzalez and Gonzalez inside the Miami 45 tendency right now to put the ball in danger. Here's the 20th play of the day for Kansas City only five runs and here's Thigpen trying to scramble for a first down comes up five yards shy Ronaldo Hill goes they were coming out short this direction in warm ups. So fourth down and five for the Chiefs to maintain possession throw underneath this complete to Dwayne Bow and Bow Gonzalez. Part of the trips to the left in motion. And it's Johnson. Fumble the ball though, and Thigpen picks it up. And Thigpen down to the eight yard line, and that's going to be close on the scramble. They need a short run. They're not geared up this offense to get it, so they're going to stay with a pass. Thigpen underneath. Gonzalez drives to the end zone, and it is a touchdown. Oh, anytime you see Thigpen under the center and you're a defense, you better be thinking quarterback draw if you're Tony Sperano and the Miami Dolphins. What a nice job by. Behind the fullback, Polite. Here comes the blitz and the give to Brown. He's got running room out there. 40, 50, one man to stop him, and it's uh, Brown, who's, uh, as you watch the films of the Dolphin season, often he'll cut the ball back to the right side. Pennington has to hustle, does elude the rush, throws back over the middle, and it's uh, complete to Devon Best, the rookie from in the last four games plus this one. Ricky Williams now a tailback on first down, and he gets the call. 
And he has room. First down and more. Dragged down inside the 25 yard line, and flags go with it as Bernard Pollard uh, may have horse collared. 13 yard run and 12 yards on half the distance penalty. Pennington looking for the end zone. He's got his man. Touchdown to David Martin, the tight end. Well, last week it was 61 yards to David Martin and an acrobatic catch and run. And this is a perfect job right up the seam, Dan. And a perfect throw. You got a guy who's six foot four in Martin, very athletic, former basketball player. <laughs> 23 yard line thick pen goes to work a quick hitter to the Charles and Jamal Charles breaks into the clear at the 50 he has the speed can they catch him 25 20 15 10 five. Oh, he's tripped up at the two yard line by Jeremiah Bell Bell saves the touchdown Charles game it's been just the opposite as Kansas City threatens to take the lead and they've got it on Larry Johnson's drive up the middle a huge hole for Johnson as he now has his fifth touchdown of the season. Well that was just flat out. I'm going to come right here. What are you going to do about it. That's just man on man. Roddy Brown now the tailback. We're at the 820 mark of this second quarter. Miami trailing 21 17 Pennington tons of time throws complete over the middle it goes to Ted Ginn Pennington will have time to throw today yeah, Miami's had nine sacks in their last two games and only nine all year for Kansas City wide open as Devon Bess the most accurate passer in NFL history currently 65.7 percent little pressure this time then he escapes and hits again again along the at the 14 of the Chiefs and any defense uh, come up with a stop wide open is Fasano the tight end he breaks a tackle he's in the end zone touchdown Anthony Fasano he and Martin both had a touchdown catch last week in the win against uh, San Francisco 14 to 9 and they both answer with a touchdown here in the first half today. 10 nothing lead now we're back in front 24 21 here's the kickoff. It's Kevin Robinson. And Robinson uh, takes it out. May have fumbled the ball outside the 30 yard line, and the Dolphins say they've recovered. And they have. So the turnover to Miami. They lead the NFL. Differential today in turnover, so plus 14 on the year for the league leaders. Let's see how they can take advantage. Quick tosses to Ricky Williams, and Williams pounds it down. This crowd, oh, the referee triplet goes down as he was backpedaling. Trying to get in position. Throw by Pennington. Complete underneath again. And again with a catch. So Brandon London, the first year receiver from Massachusetts, replaces him. He's out to the right. On first down at the 14. Good play action. Pennington throws underneath. And it's caught by Ricky Williams. And Williams. Ernest Wilford in motion. Pennington dumps it into the flat to Brown. Brown corralled at the five, tries to get inside of the four, and he's tumbled down. He's marked right at the five yard line, a yard shy of the first down. And Polite has been the man they've used on fourth and one. Let's see if he gets the handoff. No, Pennington to throw the fade, and it is going to fade away from the receiver. And out of bounds, Joey Hanos, the rookie from Maryland, and that's Miami now defensively trying to stop. Kansas City deep in their own end get the ball back here but Johnson is going to deny that he has a first down and he steps out of bounds with Kansas City when trailing at halftime have lost 11 in a row as an offside and a free play for Thigpen who throws it long this time for Darling makes the catch and I believe he was in bounds yes he was they're going to mark it complete at the 36 so that's when you want to throw the ball 55 and the defense and penalties decline First down at the 35 as Kansas City trying to take the lead before halftime. Their two wins they led at halftime this year. Scramble. Thigpen, all kinds of room to run. 20. Look at him gallop inside the 10. They love Tyler Thigpen in Kansas City. 49 yards rushing, 27 on that carry. But First he's always goal. In, he's always in the shotgun, so he's always facing the whole field. Oh, that was a quarterback draw. It still is. And it's a touchdown. Oh my! Well, now you go back to the decision not to kick the field goal. The decision to throw a fade route to a tight end has only caught one pass all year, and the uh, Dolphins are burned by Tyler Thigpen and the Chiefs. 
peeling off the walls when Tony Sperano gets his team in there in a little while. Third and ten for Pennington. Steps up, gets it to Brown, and Brown drives right to the yellow line, right to the sticks, and I believe he has the first down. We'll see. He had it too when they had the ball down there on the seven yard line. That's when they should have kicked the last field goal. Pennington on the run and almost is it intercepted. Yes, Jared Page pulls it in and the turnover and that's rare for Pennington and Miami. But Page read it all away and ran to the spot uh, into this wind swirling and uh, against the kicker. Screen it. Charles picks up his blockers. Gets out of that problem and all the way to the 45 yard line of Miami and the timeout called with one second left in the half. Dragon back across the formation. Let him run with the ball. See if he can break some tackles. Big Ben rolling to buy himself some time. And now on the run throws a wobbler. <laughs> no chance. No chance. Yeah, yeah, that one got out of his hand. Well, he was lucky that one wasn't picked off. That was an ugly duck. Porter, who has 17 and a half sacks at the start today, but hasn't come close to a touch. And look at wide open Larry Johnson. He's got blockers with him. 50, sidesteps a couple of tacklers inside the 40 yard line. And the Chiefs continue to shred this Miami defense. Richie Torbor replacing Crowder and Adele moving inside. But in this pass offense of Kansas City, here comes the blitz. And wide open is Tony Gonzalez. And Gonzalez has another Chiefs first down. It's Johnson. And he sprints to the sidelines in a first down. Gonzalez in motion. And then they gave it to Johnson. Slipped as he made his cut. Matt Roth there to secure the stop. 27 yard attempt by Connor Barth. And the rookie sends it through. Pennington with 135 yards today has his career high in yardage. And a great match, Pennington and Miami, and he adds to that as he hits Devon Bess. Never played quarterback uh, in his life, he told us, high school or college, but he's thrown a couple of passes, a couple of touchdowns out of this. And here's the reverse coming back the other way to Patrick Cobbs, and he's got blockers in front, 40, 30, and he's got speed to the 10 and knocked out of bounds inside the five, saving the touchdown, Jared Page. Brown to get that good hand on. And the real quarterback's back on the field. Cobbs with 44 yards on the play, and here's the handoff to Williams. Outside he goes, and Ricky Williams is in the end zone for a touchdown. Williams' fourth rushing touchdown of the season, and Miami an extra point away from tying it up. And now it's Kansas City. Big Penn in that spread formation. And he's going to go deep, deep, deep. This is for Bradley. Jump ball, and Bradley wins it. 42-yard line of the Dolphins. Must be getting cold in the booth, JB. You're having <laughs> some of the same verbal locks that we are here in Kansas City. Over the middle, and no problem for Gonzalez as he snares another. Not uh, willing to take a third round draft pick, Kansas City. Big Penn goes to the sideline, right to the Miami Dolphins, Nathan Jones. And Jones with the interception. Down inside the 10, it was intended for DeVar Darling, I think. Mile High Stadium crew not to show any scores. They didn't want his team to know how San Diego's doing. But if Denver wins, they're in the playoffs. Pennington hit from behind, but still can get it off. He was not brought down. And again, that allows the open field here for Ronnie Brown. Hurdles his way out to the 28 and a first down. They better figure out a way to finish here. Ronnie Brown at the tailback position in the Wildcat. Fakes the handoff. And on the keeper, he vaults his way out to midfield. And then Kansas City drove the field 95 yards for a touchdown to take the lead. Pennington hits Bess, and Bess down to the 36-yard line. And they've hung in there. On second down, Pennington steps away from pressure, dumps it off to Ricky Williams, and Williams breaks a tackle. And he's finally to the 20-yard line. Third and a short four, though, for the first down. Empty backfield. Here comes the blitz, and the quick throw is complete. And it's going to go to the tight end, Fasano, and he's to the end zone for a touchdown. And Miami grabs the lead. Flag is down. A beautiful job by Pennington to recognize the blitz. Personal foul, face mask, defense. 
Welcome fans who have been watching CBS end of election elsewhere to Frigid Arrowhead Stadium Kansas City trailing Miami 38 31 the swing pass out the backfield is complete to Jamal Charles from Tyler Thigpen Larry Johnson is the tailback and Gonzalez in motion fake to Johnson and Thigpen slips down at the 20 and the Dolphins take over on downs Matt Roth there to secure and Miami with a touchdown lead takes it over at the 20 yard line turnabout that has been historical for this Dolphin franchise it's Ricky Williams getting outside and now wrestle down at the seven yard line for no gain and did he fumble over there there's a scramble and Kansas City thinks they have it. There's no signal yet. There I, it is. Yeah, I didn't see down by contact signal. Demario Williams with a hit and Derrick Johnson recovered the ball. So Kansas City with 145 to go. His body touches. He is down. Is it coming out? Mm. No, it doesn't come out till after he contacts the ground, right? I think that's down by contact. It's not out until that elbow hits, but the second that elbow hits because he's being tackled. After review, they're really on the field stands. Pooch in a little meaningless field goal. And this is the end of the field where it's his iciest of all. Big Penn scrambles and he's clobbered at the seven yard line. Sacking Sean Hill for that big decider against the Niners. Stop here and it's just a couple of kneel downs for Miami in the victory. Big Penn down the middle. Intercepted at the 15, the 10. It's Ronaldo Hill inside the five. And the few Miami fans here have a chance. To join Sperano and his sideline team with a cheer. Hard earned at 38 31, and Hill with a pick his third of the season. Some rough situations in New York and then even this season, but uh, with dignity, he's moved to Miami and he's led this Miami team one game from the playoffs.